Hello Bites, Don the AS Lifter. Um, coming to you today talking about some real stuff that's going on in the world today and something maybe some young people can learn. Uh, so let's just dive right into it, get your popcorn ready. And uh, this is the cold hard truth some of you may not want to hear. But with all the crap I see in today and all this uh, craziness going on, uh, people talking about left, right, poor, rich, black, white, blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. Man, you motherfuckers need to go to the gym. Period. Because here's the reality. I know y'all y'all laugh about the meatheads and think that, you know, us in the gym, that, we, you know, we're all stupid and shit. But we figured out something none of y'all people have figured out yet. Number one rule thing we figured out is we don't care what color you are. When you come in the gym, I don't care if you're black. I don't care if you're white. I don't care if you're Hispanic, Asian. But I, I don't care if you're green and from Mars. I can give a crap less. All I care about is what you put on that bar and how much effort you put into it. Period. Another thing that, that people, you know, at the gym have that... Uh, I guess society hasn't figured out yet. That is, we don't care what you do for a living. We don't care how much money you make. I don't care what clothes you wear coming in there. I don't care if you've got $100 shoes. It doesn't do you no good if you got a $10 squat. Period. Again, it comes back to effort. So let's break that down. While all those people, you know, work out, and all those people in the gym, we all kind of just don't think we're that intelligent. We figured it out a long time ago. And I'm not talking about you know, Planet Fitness and nothing against them, you know, fitness is fitness, but I'm not talking, I'm talking about a real gym. You know, in real gyms, when people come to work out and you got a brotherhood and a sisterhood and everybody's in there, you know, working together and, and, and uh, getting after it and come, working for a common goal, they could care less what color your skin is. I have seen people come in there, no heart, I, that's the ones I don't have no respect for. No heart. You have no heart. You have no work ethic. You ain't trying. You ain't putting in the effort. You ain't trying to drive. You ain't positive. Motivating everybody else. Because that's the other thing I don't see in this world. I see no positivity. It's all negative. It's all BS crap. The news. And turn that crap off. Get your ass in the gym. Simple. You know, there's basic sayings in the gym that y'all can take a lot of heat from. Number one by a great man named C.T. Fletcher was fuck your excuses. We ain't got no excuses. Either you lift it or you don't. It's that simple. Stop whining. Stop crying. Stop complaining. Get your ass in the gym. You got frustration? You want to go tear up shit, break windows and shit? Get your ass in the gym. Lift some weights. Lift some shit. Get that frustration out. Start thinking a positive about yourself. Because, man, you motherfuckers in the world, y'all ain't got, y'all ain't, y'all are fucking lost. All us in the gym, we doing good. My workout, buddy? My friend, he's not white, but guess what? He's got fucking heart, he tries, and he's the most driven man I've seen. Most best workout partner I could ever ask for. Most regimented guy I've ever had. I was on a team, mixed. White, black, Hispanic, guess what? It didn't matter. What mattered was, what can you lift? What can you do? When you get on that platform of powerlifting, the only thing that matters is, what's your numbers? I don't give a shit what color you are. There's powerlifters that are black that are great. There's powerlifters that are white that are great. There's, I mean, who gives a crap? Y'all motherfuckers need to get your ass in the gym. Just simple. Stop the bullshit. Stop the whining. Stop the complaining. Stop the crying. Because somewhere, somehow, we done figured this shit out a long time ago. Take it for what you want to take it. Take what you want to think. But if you go into a real gym where people are lifting real weight and trying their ass off to compete... And whether it be bodybuilding, power sports, or powerlifting, guess what? Or even gym rats, man. Guess what? They don't care what color you are. Will there always be racism in the world? Yeah, you're always going to have idiots. They're closed-minded individuals. It has nothing to do with life. But if you keep falling in the trap and keep going down the road, being negative and bringing more negativity to the world, you're spiraling yourself down. It's plain and simple. Get your ass in the gym. Go work out. Go put your effort and everything else and your heart into something. Get something out of it. Go find a brotherhood. Go find that sisterhood. It doesn't matter what color somebody is. Yeah, we all have different backgrounds. We all crack on each other for it. But you know what? At the end of the day, I got any one of their backs. Just like they got mine. It's the way it is. It's life. Y'all need to go to the gym. Y'all need to work out. Take it for what you want to take it for. Like I said, we figured this shit out a long time ago. Good luck if you don't want to. 
And remember what C.T. Fletcher also always said, it's your motherfucking step.